When my husband and I were first married, he was everything that I was looking for in a husband. He was perfect, so I thought. A few years into our marriage, he had a very powerful conversion. And though my husband was head of our household, I was the spiritual leader of our family. Our roles switched from me being the spiritual leader to him. It was hard for me in the beginning to surrender and submit to my beloved. It was very unfamiliar territory and a little scary. If you would have told me on our wedding day where we'd be today, I would have laughed. But through our Lord, he has become more than I could imagine. He's still handsome, masculine, romantic, honest, and still has kind eyes. All of these qualities are magnified because of his love for our Lord. He never leaves the house without his catechism and Bible. He takes our sons everywhere he goes, so they will know how to be men. And over the years, our intimacy and love have grown more magnificent and unlike any I've ever known. And as my beloved embraces me, he loves me with such tenderness, I hardly feel deserving of his love. My husband has grown in holiness. I don't think people who knew him before his conversion and his adapting of the marriage unchained principles would recognize him. A couple of years ago, me and our youngest two children were talking about my husband. They agreed that their dad loved God first, me second, and them third. What a beautiful testimony my husband is to our family. By Kathy from Indianapolis.